Okay, so we're back from our crusher simulation, and uh, if you remember, we did uh, a one-hour climb, and we chose uh, the uh, this segment this on Strava, the four-man, poor man, Sunshine Gold Hill, to go for, and uh, that was the Sepcus uh, 53, whatever. Um, but uh, so here we're gonna go over our data and uh, look at how we did. Um, first off. So we have Strava on the left, we got Training Peaks on the right. Um, I got fourth overall on this segment. Crazy, how he uh, kind of, that uh, exceeded my expectations. Jackson here on the camera uh, is second overall. Took uh, three minutes off your time, your PR? Something like that. I've never done this segment before, so um, I don't have a PR, this <laughs> is my new PR. Um, but so this was the segment, it was uh, 57, 07. Here's the uh, here's the full effort. You got Sep Jackson. I don't know who you are, and I don't know who Jason Woods is. But congrats to you guys. Y'all are beasts. Um, let's look at the uh, the power. This is uh, so I, I always say to my athletes, Strava's for fun, Training Peaks is for the analysis. And so so here we are, and um, the segment started from back here. So I, you can uh, scroll right, look at the normalized power, and that comes out, you know, that's pretty equivalent to what the uh, Strava segment was, but I did, uh, so wait, that's a little bit under. Let me make, let me get this closer to the segment. 56.47, we'll just call it there. So um, I did 281 watts normalized, and that is 94% of my FTP, so that was, uh, Sweet spot watts for me, and uh, it felt like threshold, and we'll, we'll talk about that in a second. But um, there was uh, three three segments to this uh, this this climb. So this was poor man's, and that's a lower elevation, more oxygen, we're fresher in the ride, and I did uh, 290 watts for 14 minutes, and then we went down a little descent. Um, <clears throat> it was like a flat part, and then we banged the left, and this is the the steepest section of uh, Sunshine Canyon. This is the 11.5 percent grade here, and uh, I was feeling pretty good, so I was able to uh, push 315 watts. And then there's that little little downhill here, and this is from here to here is kind of rolly. This is where Jackson was f talking and dropping me. Yeah, and I did uh, 292, about 282 watts average. I didn't feel good. I probably paid the price for going, doing 316 here, and that's what happens. You do, uh, you know, 280 there. So that's like a 30 watt differential. That's what happens when you're my age. Yeah, I have, a, I have a little bit of an age advantage. Jackson is impervious to that. <laughs> anyway, so <clears throat> you go down the little saddle here, and this is where the dirt begins, right here. So you got the GPS here, but you can also see um, if you, this is, the dirt begins and my power drops. And so one of the reasons why we did this segment is there, this is a very steep dirt climb, 7%. Seven, 7%. Um, this was a 25 minute section and the dirt is like the coal to crusher. So similar in length, similar in elevation grade, but the dirt, the stutter bumps from the car, it's loose rocks. It's just, if you just imagine waves coming in on the coast, and it's just one after the other and your bike just kind of bounces over them. And it's really tough to just get in a rhythm and just lay down the watts like you can on a section of road like here where I did, you know, 315. You just can't do that over the stutter bumps unless you're like a watt monster. I don't like, know. Like me. Like Jackson. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> who, you, who put two minutes into me on this section. But this is what's going to happen in the cold of Crusher. So we want to we want to practice how we want to play. And this is how you do it. So I suffered immensely here. I did um, uh, 278 watts normal. Like I said, this is sweet spot wattage felt like threshold it was hard and uh um but yeah overall a super training day for me and whenever you can go hard for you know 57 minutes that's what you're gonna have to do in the race 
and uh, that's as specific as it gets. That's a, what you call a race specific workout right there. Um, and then to make this ride even more race specific, Jackson and I, we got to Gold Hill right here, if you see on the, the GPS, um, Gold Hill. And uh, for those who are familiar with Gold Hill, if you we stopped, but this we plunged down, it's called Lick Skillet. This is a, it says negative 6.4% grade, but it sure felt steeper than that. Um, maybe, let's look at the percent grade of this part. Negative 14%, that's more like it. That was steep, that's like you're riding the brakes, you're hoping that there's nothing bumpy to send you over the handlebars. But the cool thing about this is, uh, this is like, you know, you go up the first climb of the crusher, and then you're gonna plunge down the coal to crusher, and so we got a little more simulation there. And, um, you know, then uh, we came down left hand and we went up Rowena, which is a super rocky um, ascent. I had to put my foot down twice to uh, neg negotiate the, the rocks. There wasn't a very good line. I fell off my bike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And everyone that's watching us, yes, you can heckle us because you can ride it, but uh, it was hard. It was uh, gravel specific. And then we did this escape route, um, which was new to me. I've never done that. And that was wicked steep. And I don't think it's even rough. It's probably like, right? This is, yeah, that's. Yeah, the, there's like three pretty yeah. real steep switchbacks. 14%. It only <clears throat> took us three minutes and 19 seconds, but that felt a lot harder than it did. And uh, then we just uh, plunged down deer trail and uh we were gonna do bow mountain uh, to linden but uh they had already started road construction for the day and there was like a 15 minute wait and we just couldn't wait to get back and analyze our data to see our results um but overall uh i did 158 tss in two and a half minutes and that's a super quality uh ride um i call that a working man working man's crusher simulation 158 TSS before 10 a.m. That's a that's a good training day. Mm -hmm.